Hello, my nerd musician friend. So, I'm here in Muncie, Indiana, and I just left Ball State University where I work to go home. And it's spring break, but I was working, so it doesn't feel like break. And as you can see, it doesn't feel like spring either. It's kind of cold. There's snow, and I was thinking, while all those kids are playing on the beach, like, having fun listening to music, doing 30 things. What can I do to have fun? So what people that know music and technology understand about Arduinos do when they don't have anything to do and they're bored? They make MIDI controllers. So in this video, I'm going to attempt the most cold challenge that I have ever done, which is trying to make a MIDI controller with eyes from a frozen pond. So brace yourselves, my friend, because winter is coming. No, winter is leaving. I hope so. Soon. So I had this idea when I was coming to work and everything was still frozen. And now I was like, like it was all covered by snow and now things are melting and birds are happier and I was like oh shit <laughs> the, the, the pond is probably uh, not frozen anymore but here is the pond and it looks pretty frozen to me so let's take a look so here is the pond and I'll have to get there in those rocks, break the ice somehow, get the ice pieces and make a MIDI controller somehow. So how can I make a MIDI controller with ice, right? So usually we use buttons which like you close a circuit, you have the ground and you have the positive and when you close the circuit, you send a note, you can send a MIDI note. But how can I make a button? send MIDI notes with ice. So my idea is making a capacitive sensor with water, frozen water. So I'm going to use for this project a TNC board. A TNC board is an Arduino compatible that actually have touch pins, which are pins that you can just attach something and it's going to uh, tell you the change in the capacitance in that sensor. So hopefully I can get some ice pieces and uh, connect to a TNC, program the TNC and send some notes, make a MIDI controller and hopefully I will not freeze to death until the end of this project, okay? So let's get started. So first challenge will be getting the ice without falling in the pond and freezing to death. So I'm gonna come here slowly and really careful and try to get some ice. I'm here and <laughs> it looks safe so far. So that's the ice. So I guess if I... Nope. And I brought a friend. <laughs> Let's see if this will work at all. Fuck, this ice is thick. I'm never going to break it. Well, it seems that it's impossible to break the ice. So what should I do? Let's see around. 
so maybe I can get the eyes from another part which is down here look can you see it there's some tiny pieces and I think that they might be usable Beautiful, look at that. And here is my eyes. My hands are already freezing. Like, I'm not feeling my fingers anymore. And, oh, what do we do? So look at that. Oh, 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 oh. Here's my eyes. Look at my hands, they're pink. This. Oh, come here, buddy. I'm not really not comfortable position right now. And see all the leaves below the eyes. Oh, oh. looks like a face. Oh my God, looks like an alien face. Pieces of ice, and now we have to build a MIDI controller with it. Okay, now we need to find a place to build this controller. So uh, let's grab the ice. Oh, it's so hard. I need a camera person. This is enough for you guys. We stay, Mr. Cold Alien. So I think I'm gonna build it right by the pond where my failed attempt happened first. I think it's gonna be beautiful. So, let's try not fall again. It has some dirt, but you don't mind, right? So I changed my mind and I decided to do it right here because I think it's gonna be way more beautiful, right? So I'm trying, I'm gonna try to hang the pieces of ice that are already melting and like kind of uh, going to trying to mount them here okay and uh i have the suspicious suspicious uh that it won't work because this is metal and then it's going to conduct everything and it's just going to screw it up and i won't be able to get the individual notes but i'll try let's see so first i got some wire which I'm gonna use with like a rope. I'm gonna hang this with this. Uh, I'm gonna make a small hole. I'm gonna make a small hole in the ice. Put the rope. Yeah, got it. Hope the cops don't get into action right here. Can I always say it's art. Look at that. I have no idea how my fan hands feel. Fuck. How my hands feel right now. I can barely move my fingers. Oh fuck. It hurts. Okay, so I have my Tinsy board in hand and uh, put in this breadboard and hopefully we'll make it work. It's hard to do it recording and doing and freezing. Okay, I'll get the wires. 
we have to follow the Tinsy uh, pin out to know which one have which ones have the touch pins. So I'm gonna get the wire. I'm going to attach that to the eyes. That's the question. Oh fuck, that's gonna be hard. Pin two. Ah. Just try to hang this. I don't know what I'm doing with my life. Ugh. So it's touching. Um, okay, let's do one more wire. You know, guys, I have been preparing for this moment. I'm doing the Winhof method. <laughs> do you know who's Winhof? He has like lots of records, longest that someone can stay on the ice. And I have been taking cold showers every day with the breathing technique. And that helps to clean your, your blood. So get my computer now. Let's open the Arduino sketch. Ooh, it's cold. So I gotta open the sketch. This gotta be tin CLC. MIDI, yeah, all good. And let's open Ableton Live. I hear the cops, I hope they're not coming for me. This is scary and exciting. I doubt that's actually going to work, but at least I know I tried. So that's my MIDI controller. debug this right here right now so we have to print to see if we're getting any values there I'm getting cold like fucking cold so let's see what we are getting in our serial monitor what okay so we are getting some but are we getting something from sensors fuck I wanna be let's try it again let's try it again I changed something in the code I can tell you later oh shit maybe it's working Passive sensors are really tricky because you gotta configure them. How can I do this? Oh, guys, it's getting hard. 700 here. I'm adjusting the threshold. Oh shit. Okay, don't get full. Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god. It's working really bad, but it's... You get the idea. <laughs> yeah, guys, so I made a MIDI controller made of ice from the frozen pond during a spring break. That was the coldest thing I've ever done. My hands are 
dying and I'm freezing and I need to go home. And I hope you enjoy that because it was, it was hard. And if you want to learn how to make this, I have this free course here uh, where I teach how to make MIDI controllers and a full course where I teach much more. And uh, if you want to become my patron and help me to do more videos like that, I can tell you how excited I am with the next things I want to do. My life is going to change. Things are going to change. The channel is going to change. I can't tell you right now, but things are coming up. So, see the links below, and please tell me what you, what you thought about it, and like, what do you want to see me doing next, okay? So, 